Hey guys, how you going? Uh, so this is going to be September's Organization B event. It's actually going to be Demix. So this is going to be a bit of a weird one. Uh, the reason being that in the Japanese version, this was the very, very first Organization B13 event to come out. Um, I'm not sure if they're going to make it more difficult or if they're literally going to copy the exact same event that came out in the Japanese version a year ago and just port it to our version. Um, it's going to be very, very interesting to see. Like. Starting off now, we're only versing level 5 enemies, so I haven't honestly looked at the Japanese version at all in terms of how difficult their event was, but I mean, knowing our translating team, not to be too harsh on them, but I really wouldn't put it past them just to completely unnerf it and, uh, sorry, like to, to not buff the metal at all and to also not buff the events at all and just make it literally exactly the same copy and paste from the Japanese version. Um, which would make the metal pretty much useless to us <laughs> because it's a metal that's, a, you know, literally a year old. It's a, I believe the Japanese version was a tier 4 metal. It did more damage, like, based on the higher your HP was or something, and the multiplier was like 3-ish, 3.2 or something. I don't, I don't know, we can, we can check it in a bit. But if that's the case now, then it's not really going to be useful to us at all. Yeah, look at those rewards there, friggin... Um, Silver, Huey, Louie, and Dewey. Um, <laughs> what's the condition here? Complete within 45 seconds, okay. Um, yeah, I can really see them not even changing this at all. We'll, we'll, we'll find out. I suppose we'll find out in a second. It's literally seven minutes since the event came out. Um, so we could be one of the first to find out. But let's go. Okay, so we're going to do a full playthrough. I'll try and pause between all the quests as per usual, but this could be a very... A very short video, depending on how difficult or not difficult it is. Again, we have medals that are so far superior to what even the Japanese version had a year ago. You know, we're only four months behind. <sighs> Facebook messaging, the bane of my existence, honestly. Bane of my existence. <laughs> Alright, that was part two. Um, this could be my lowest viewed video ever if no one needs any help with doing it because it's too easy. I mean, I'm pretty sure having like 0.2 Kairi alone We'll clear out this entire quest for you, so... Oh, let's pause, get to number three. Okay, I guess we'll find out soon. Part number three is where we get our first actual medal for Demix B, um, so we can see what his stats are. If the multiplier's gone, like, way up, then maybe he could justify his four gauge cost. But in the current meta, like, four gauge cost for a medal that doesn't do any buffing or debuffing of any kind, it's, like, so, so, so far too little too late. Okay, complete within 100 seconds, so this shouldn't be too difficult. I'm wondering if the time limit refers to when you fight him in Kingdom Hearts 2 and his, his data version, uh, the way that he throws the clones at you and you only have a certain amount of time to take out all the clones. I think the most difficult one is where you have like, oh, there's another enemy there. You only have like, what, 13 seconds or something to take out. And then maybe it's 30 seconds to take out 99 clones or something ridiculous. And you like pretty much have to use wisdom form and do like Fire Argus Spam. It's a really fun fight, really fun fight if you know what you're doing. Um, yeah, again, this could be one that is <laughs> really, really not helpful to anyone, simply because our medals are literally eight months stronger than what they're meant to be for this level of content. Like I said, I really, really hope our translating team has put some effort into this, but I guess we'll see, won't we? All right, this is part three. Pretty much done with literally no effort at all. <laughs> Tend to go. Tend to go. But let's um, take a look at the medal real quick. Do, 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 do. Yes, 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 yes. Come on. Oh, boy. Um, <laughs> what else is there to talk about, really? Again, you guys are probably literally skipping through all this right now to get to the more difficult ones, if anyone's watching at all. Again, this quest could be completely, completely unbuffed, in which case... No one's going to need a guy, I'm sure, because, again, our medals are eight months stronger than this is designed for. All right, let's pause and have a look. Okay, so here is our very first Demix B copy, and I, like I said, I really don't know, but I don't feel like that multiplier has gone up at all. Yeah, okay, so if you can't get this medal, then it's really nothing too bad because it's <laughs> hardly worth having, but oh well. Um, in terms of traits, I guess one of the negative 60s would be good, but... Yeah, who really cares? <laughs> Let's just get it anyway. Okay, part number four, beat it within 80 seconds. Again, just, it's going to be pretty bog standard, I think. Um, 
walk up to the target enemy, press Nova, win. Um, I think these guys have pretty high defenses, but again, this is our version of the game we're talking about. We could probably just do one debuff. Let's find out. There you go. Yeah, one debuff, pretty much blow them away. Again, because this quest is only designed for like a plus three, minus three um, buff system, and we can easily surpass plus seven now, so... Uh, I don't know how many ways I can say this is disappointing without making you guys completely bored, but... Yeah, <laughs> that's pretty much how I feel, unfortunately. Um, I don't know, it's like, all the money we put into this... Well, not we, because I haven't put a cent into this game. But, people put into this game, it's like... Man, how many hundreds of dollars, if not thousands and thousands, were spent on that Sephiroth EX banner, and... It's like, this is what you're paying for. Just a, literally a copy and paste. Uh, the people that are making it obviously either don't care or don't understand why we'd want A, the metal to be more powerful, but B, even the content to be more powerful. Like, as it is, this is just going to be an exercise in... There's no there's no challenge here. I sincerely doubt there will be a challenge. We're just going to walk up to the enemy, kill them with our extremely overpowered metals, collect our shitty Demix B metal, and then... I don't know. I guess we're doing this for Nova. We're doing this for six points of Nova, basically. Oh, well. Um... If, well, so the Japanese version right now, obviously they're not having another Demix B reprint. What they are having is a, it's like an Organization 13 big event where it looks like, looks like you can get, I think it's like five, uh, four of each medal, unfortunately. And if, unfortunately only four, uh, which means that anyone like me and I'm sure plenty of you other guys that were hoping to get Xemnas B, I kind of shit out of luck. Sorry, I may have explained that poorly. They're having an event. I believe it's like one every day in which you can try and get the old Organization 13 B medals, I think. I think. And um, like I said, I think like day one would be Xemnas, for example. So I think you can get up to four Xemnas B medals on the first day. I think. I don't know. I, again, I haven't watched any Japanese content. It's just what I, what I heard on the Reddits. Um... But yeah, like, that's a really nice idea, and I'm pretty sure Roxas B will be out by the end of the, end of the 13 days. I don't know, I'd probably fact check the stuff before I start talking about it, but, um, it would be cool, if not for the fact that <laughs> I'm sure so many of us, um, well, yeah, for anyone that missed out on, like, guilting Zexion B, for example, or Lexeus, or whatever his name is, and... Any, any of the above, like if you didn't get Molusha B because you didn't start playing that long ago and you're only able to pick up like one or two copies, this is a great time for you to be able to get back into it. Ooh, only 30 seconds, quick. Um, for the rest of us, it'll be a good opportunity to do trait rolls. Like a lot of us have the Organization 13 medals, but they existed before traits came out, so they won't have any traits on them. It's a good chance to try and. Let's be quick. Good chance to try and get traits on them. Um, you bastard, you ba Whoa! God damn it. I gotta do it again. Let's do it again. Okay, that's much better if you don't actually spend a lot of time wasting time talking to the camera and actually do the quest quickly. It's no challenge at all. <laughs> again, not that I expected it to be. Um, and you could probably run up the top and find there's no enemies up there either, I, I guess. I'm just... I did the same path I did before, except without faffing about, so... Ooh, exactly 666 likes. It's a good omen. So that was part, what... Five or six? I don't know. I'm not really keeping count. Um, <laughs> I feel like I should just fast forward this. Because no one's going to watch it anyway. This is going to be the lowest rated video I've ever had. <laughs> oh, God. Man, it's so disappointing. It's like, do you think the, the staff responsible for translating the event are just, like, not confident enough in themselves to produce their own content in terms of... Maybe they're worried about backlash from cranking the end, like, the... Um, the metal stats up at all, like touching them at all, or making the event too difficult. They just had no faith in their own ability to make the game, so they're just like, you know what, we'll just copy and paste it exactly as it was. Basically, they can deal with it. This looks like one of those ones where you should follow the path of the sparklies. Or maybe not, maybe I just made that up. Okay. <laughs> it's a big challenge. I know, guys, a really huge challenge. And this is so disappointing. God, just give us something. Okay, just run completely across the top, I guess. Whoa, hello. Oops, 
Nasty Daisies. Okay, <laughs> slight, slight detour there, but it's all still fine. Man, and um, I'm kind of assuming we'll get a guilting campaign for our our anniversary, so maybe hang on to this guy until then if you want to uh, guilt him then. Um, it should only be a couple more months away, I, I guess. I don't actually know when our version of the game came out. I suppose look up my my KH2 Kari videos and then add a year onto that date. Because I'm pretty sure that's when... I'm pretty sure she came out for our anniversary. It's rebranded as Union Cross. <sighs> Alright, let's pause. Okay, a bunch of balloons for quest number 8. Same as usual though, I'm pretty sure that's not going to be any challenge. <laughs> Oh man, have I even used... Oh, yeah, I was going to say, have I even used a special attack yet? But um, I just remembered that I had. Oh, okay. These are going to blow up for us. Beautiful. <laughs> oh, yeah, yeah. I wonder what the highest level of enemy in this quest is actually going to be. Because we're at 135 now for part... What? Part 7? Who cares? It's fine. I'm just... Okay, we can't actually see the quest name. I don't know why we could. That's never, ever been a thing in this game. Okay, up to the enemy. Just tap him real quick. Hopefully that animation plays out quickly. Bang, 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 bang. Freaking victory animation. Okay, good. Within... It's within 45 seconds, right? Not within 40. Hopefully. Hopefully. <laughs> Let's just pause it anyway. You guys don't care. Okay, beat Cerberus within uh, 30 seconds for part number 9. That's pretty cool. Um... 30 seconds, man. This could have been challenged literally eight months ago. He has six bars of health, people. Six bars of health in 30 seconds. How the hell is anyone meant to be able to do that? No one's that strong. And luckily for us, I suppose, we can just... Oh, no. <laughs> I thought that might kill him in one hit, but uh, I guess I was wrong. Oh, well, 17 seconds. Man, that could have been difficult back in the day. If that if this is exactly how the events appeared. What would you have had to done? What would you have had as a buff? Would you have would you have had Illustrated KH1 Kari back then? I'm sure. It's only a year ago. You must have you must have had it. So you would have paid thirty thousand jewels to Mercy Pool uh, KH1 Kari, and that would have been really really wise investment. Definitely, you know, inflation is a bitch. <laughs> what else would you have had? Maybe maybe Piglet, maybe Pooh and Piglet. You would have had. Oh, I don't know. Classic Donald. No, no, no. You wouldn't have had Classic Donald yet. That came out a bit after. What's this condition? Within 20 seconds, guys, come on. Level 170. Maybe they have maybe they have buffed it up a bit. Who knows? Again, I really can't even be bothered going back in and looking at. <laughs> what was the point of that? <laughs> what was the point? Why not put him right in front of us? Or just make the condition five seconds less? I don't, <laughs> I don't get it. Oh, uh, God. What would you have used to beat Cerberus back in the day? I mean, obviously, like... Uh, anything magical. Like, Illustrated Terra A, maybe, would have been out by then. Uh, any of the Donald medals. I'm sure you would have found something that would have helped you through it. Oof. Alright, next part done. Next part done. Let's pause it real quick. Quest number 11. Defeat a level 180 Gargoyle within, what, 80 seconds? I didn't really read it. Oh, man. Man, oh man, oh man. At least new players will be able to guild the medal, I suppose. But, I mean, I'm pretty sure anyone could guild this medal. Anyone. Like, I've used, like, three special attacks in the entire video. And that's partly out of laziness. Like, I can't even be bothered switching my setup to an appropriate setup. Like, surely everyone in this game is going to be able to fully guild this medal with no problem at all. Like, the power jump has just been that significant. Like, even the difficult enemies now, they're giving it to you. <laughs> I don't get it. Oh, here we go. This is a challenge. This is a challenge. Level 180 Gargoyle without one of those little things there to actually help us kill it. <sighs> we managed to get through somehow. That's lucky. Very lucky for us. Oops. If I can actually get around the terrain. The terrain is the most challenging part by far. Okay. Hopefully no more enemies. There we go. And they give us a... Ooh, we got 15 seconds left. Give us a little bag of balloons there to kill the final enemy for us. So really, all you have to do is reach him. 
Man. This is challenging content back in the day. Oh, God. It wasn't... Like, wasn't my Lucia level... Like, a level 500 enemies in that quest? Like, it was two months after this. And they were throwing, like, level 500 witches at us or something. Or am I misremembering that? Maybe it was, like, a level 300 with... With a ridiculous counter on it. Remember, I only beat that quest because someone was sharing a second chance medal. And that was like... Holy crap, someone someone actually has a second chance medal? I was like the biggest scrub back then. You know, I didn't want to do any raids to get my levels up. I didn't have any decent medals whatsoever. Every time I hit 3,000 jewels, I just pulled immediately. Did a man of the banner. I was like, yes, I can do a pull. I've been waiting months for this. Oop, oopsie daisies. Okay, part number 12. For the sacred tradition, just to do the full event. Uh, level 190, Morning Star. Again, I'm not going to change my setup whatsoever because it's really not even worth the time. <laughs> Man. Are we just going to sprint to the end for the boss? No. No, we're not. This guy has 80,000 health, people. 80,000 health. Be really careful when you're trying to take him on. <laughs> One special attack and two taps and we're taking him out. Now, we should, like, I would love to be able to show myself or, like, anyone from a year ago the medals that we have now and be like, look, this is what you'll get <laughs> soon. Don't spend 30,000 jewels trying to get friggin, I don't know, Ansem, like, yeah, Illustrated Ansem or something on a, a Temple Mercy. Don't do it. You know, we're going to get a lot more jewels, <laughs> a lot more better medals really soon with orbs on them, believe it or not. God, the warnings I would have loved to have sent back in time. Stop people spending so much money on this game. <laughs> hey, let's use Sephiroth, why not? Chop. Damn, that's cool. Such a cool, such a cool animation. Alright, nearly there, kids. Oh, it's still going. We gotta hurry up, we only got 50 seconds left. Come on, come on, come on. <laughs> Wouldn't that be embarrassing if I didn't make it? <laughs> okay, 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 okay. Target, surely the target's here. Surely. Here we go. How long have I got? A little bit of time left. Oh, there's a balloon. Just to make it really easy for us, there's a balloon. Bah. And there we go. Part 12 done. <laughs> Surely no one's watching this. Surely absolutely no one needs any help with this whatsoever. It's going to get like 150 pity views. There'll be some ridiculous comment going, talking about how difficult it is and how they need help with Quest 11 or something. Alright, next part, last part. Oops, missed the thing. Okay, and to finish it off, part number 13, defeat a ooh, level 200 Possessor Swarm within 25 seconds. That's that's asking a lot. That's asking a lot of people back in the day. Yeah. Alright, here we go. I really wonder how much just one of these attacks is going to do. A copycat metal boosted Kyrie. Bang, and then... Okay... Because didn't the timer not stop until... When did the timer stop back in the day? Like, now, now it stops, like, right on the mark. But didn't it... Didn't it take a bit longer? Yeah, no, it didn't stop until after the thing actually pop went away. That could have been difficult. Sorry. Um, it stops now when, like, when one turn triumph comes up, right? But I'm pretty sure it didn't stop in the day until you literally faded out of the quest. So, that could have been pretty challenging for people back in the day. Alrighty, we are done. We are all done with this stupid event. It took us... Half an hour. <laughs> what a waste of time. All right, let's go. Uh, let's go fuse this thing together, huh? Okay, here we go. Let's roll some traits. Bang, 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 and bang. Four gauges. All right. So that should. Oh, <laughs> Luke Sword gets uh, put in that list as well. Okay, fuse them together. Here we go. <clears throat> um, I'm never, ever, 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 ever going to use this metal, but um, uh, I suppose. Maybe there are some conditions in, like, Proud Mode where you need a... Yeah, it's not a bad start. You need a metal that has, like, four gauges, maybe? Or it's a reverse magic? I'm pretty sure I'm stuck on one of the uh, Proud Mode quests trying to get all three Mickey heads where you need, like, four gauges and you need to kill all the enemies within, like, one hit or something. Okay. Um, again, I'm never going to use it, so strength is probably better. Four gauge cost is way too high to even consider using Alrighty, here we go. Number three. I'm not even going to bother waiting for the animations. Nope, we don't need defense. Demix is not a defensive metal, uh, defensive organization member. He seems like 
the kind of guys who run away. Alright, one down, one to go. Boop, 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 more defense, garbage. Oof, nearly fused. Look sword A. We'll be getting him next month as well, and I suppose we'll be getting an unnerfed or unbuffed version of his medal as well, so gonna be hardly any point doing that too, unless they're like Okay, so we're sticking with strength, it looks like. <laughs> sleep resist. Demix with sleep resist, it's like the opposite. He's like always taking naps, right? Isn't that his shtick? Okay, we need experience. Optimize that, there we go. And of course, there's no guilting campaign right now, so I'm probably not going to guilt it, because this guy is literally worth more to me as Nova than he is as a damage medal, so I don't want to have to waste... I want to waste the minimum amount of mirrors. Um, actually, you know what, if we're going to get a Demix reroll event in the next two months, maybe it's worth rolling him now, because then we only have to wait a little while to reroll him, and we should get we should get four rerolls, so... How many of those do I have? Oh, i got plenty. Okay. Ba -ba 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 -ba. All done. Two of those, and away she goes. Let's make him level six. Should I roll guilt on him? Why not, right? Might as well. It's gonna get like 40%, which is exactly what it deserves. Um, evolve. There we go, nice and quick. So let's see the final multiplier now. So, which one's got strength on it? Nope, not him. Defense. Alright, let's level him up. So, Oop. throw some experience in there as well, because why not? Should we? Yeah, bugger it. Why not? Why not? Who cares? Who cares? Typically, whenever I don't wait, I get a horrific guilt roll. So, I brought this upon myself, but. Okay, that's pretty much as good as I could have hoped for, honestly. Uh, he gives me one more point of Nova now, and uh, 33 mirrors, uh, 33 points to make up later. Additional strength plus 1,000, why not? Why not? We'll take that. And a great experience roll too. Okay, should we give him a try? See how he does? Yeah, why not? Okay, so I've just thrown him on the uh, Moogle of Glory. Let's find out if he does any decent damage. I'm, uh, I'm not expecting too much, to be honest, but... Oh, here we go. Um... This is really just more of a damn. Oh, shit, I'm not gonna be. <laughs> I'm not gonna be able to use him, am I? Oh well. So we've got to get up there, do we? Oh dear. Here we go. Here's the challenge. Here we go, kids. All right, I'm a plus three. Plus three strength. Plus three. Ah, uh, sorry. Plus two magic based strength. Here we go in all his glory. That's a pretty cool animation. I'll give him that. That is a pretty cool animation. Um, shame they got a bit lazy later on with some of their animations, but that one was pretty sick. Alright guys, what a complete and utter waste of time, I'm sorry, if you're sitting here through with me on this, why? Why are you doing this? Go outside, go look at the sun, I don't know. <laughs> uh, if you need any help though, honestly, if you do need any help, if you're a new player, or you just um, don't know how to build a Keyblade in general and need some tips, honestly, I'm here, leave me a comment, and uh, yeah, have fun, enjoy your new Nova. Um, like I said, if you didn't catch why I guilty him now, I'm pretty sure um, probably two months from now we will get an event in which we should get four more copies of him. So I'm not really too fussed about not getting a perfect guilt now because I can happily re-roll him in the future. Um, yeah, apart from that, that's about it. Alright guys, <laughs> catch you next time. Bye.